I call myself an intuitive astrologer because through using the tools of astrology, I'm able to kind of look in you and around you and about you, over you, under you, and use the tool to see what's going on inside your heart and really try to um, promote a better relationship with yourself and with other people because that's what it's about, right? When you do readings, what kinds of things do you base them on? When people schedule a read with me, um, I collect their time, their date, and their place of birth. And it, with that information, you're able to pull up a natal chart. It's literally a picture of the heavens when you were born. So it's like the relationships between all the planets, the constellations, the asteroids. I mean, there are tons of things and that in our sense. universe and that if- basically reflect who we are here on the planet. So over 20 years, what I've done is um, take the science of Western astrology and kind of simultaneously open up. And we all have the ability to be master intuits. You understand? It's just a matter of how open you want to be. And I've decided I'm going to open up as far as I need to in order to do God's work. That's just my, that's my testimony. What really gets me is that when people um, don't adhere to who they are in their truth, in a particular sun sign, your body is affected. I'd like to tie that in because this is a, a medical show. Where am I? The doctors? <laughs> I have to tie that in. If your health is affected, for example, my friend, you're Pisces. I found that out. A little birdie told me. The thing is, is that Pisces people have a way of absorbing everybody's energy everybody's energy, good, bad, and indifferent. And unfortunately, I should say, fortunately, it is your gift. It's your magic, right? But it all comes through your feet. So you have to pay attention to your feet. When they get jacked up, you got a couple of bunions, some corns, if they just ache when you step out of your bed for no apparent reason, maybe, possibly, could be something is going on with your mental health with your spiritual health. Maybe you're taking on way too much stress and way too many people's emotions. So what you would do is take care of your feet so you can balance yourself out, balance your energy out. Just my opinion.